What is going on everybody? It is Fitz Miller and the Skyline back here with another video. Today, we're just gonna go around the car, drive a little bit, have a good day. I'm not too sure yet what we're gonna be getting into. But I have the Skyline back for a couple days. Now, it needs two of the rear tie rod bushings put in. If you guys didn't know, uh, some Skylines came with Hikus, which was the rear steering. This one came with it and uh, the bushings are basically shot on the end, but I'm sure it's been like that for five years or so. I'm not too worried about it. I'm gonna be careful though, not gonna rip on it. Let's show you guys how this thing looks since I got it back. Now, I know the rear is about, at about six degrees, negative six degrees of camber, and then the front, I don't know, like eight, nine, 10 maybe? I don't know, but it looks so, so good but let me go ahead and pull this thing out of the garage give you guys that nice cold start and we'll go from there this camera is not too good at light exposure but here we are oh come on come on come on there we go hell yeah i'm gonna pull it out walk around listen to this rb blast pipe goodness oh my god so here is how she sits we have good amount of room we have a good amount of room up in here uh, so that's that's pretty fitted it's tires from my last wheels in the front I just I like the way it is because it sits level and I can still turn without any issues there's slight rubbing on this corner but it's the plastic so no worries there like I said um, more camera in the front and in the rear which is just so hot and I haven't seen this thing rolling yet Try to get some rollers, try to get me driving by, doing some pulls, whatever. So let it warm up and then we'll take this baby out. I decided to go to Kung Fu Tea. As you guys can see, I picked up Spencer too and we brought my child out. We're waiting for Danny to pull up. Danny with the IS, you guys will see him in a minute. I, I'm pretty sure we're just gonna have Boba and chill out for a little while. We'll probably end up cruising and I might let Spencer drive so I can see my car rolling. Like I said, I haven't yet, so we'll see what happens. I lied. I I don't know if I told you guys Danny was bringing the IS or not, but he brought the LS. <laughs> Same Congratulations Same on thing. the new car, sir. Thank you, thank you. Oh, dude, I thought you were wearing the matching tattoo shirt nah, today, but not today. dude, let's take a look at this thing. First of all, he straight piped it almost immediately <laughs> after like getting it. Three days after I owned it. Yeah, dude. All right, we got the Junction Produce up in here. Uh, I a sub. Otherwise, mostly stock LS. But this thing's an absolute yeah. boat. Yeah. It sounds crazy. I'm not gonna lie. I'll see if he can get some rollers of me. I'll get some of him. Let's see, he got clear corners uh, and then clear reflectors as well. So, Danny, I'm excited to see this thing, dude. I'm excited to see it just dumped. I'm just waiting for tow arms. Yeah. Coming from Russia, so I don't know. Jesus, do you have I'm the like, coils in right now? No. Like I'm at just, your house, I mean? Oh, yeah, I have everything at my house. Yeah. I might just dump it and see how much the toe bolts yeah because uh pete said he doesn't have toe arms on his he just toe bolts i mean he's so, pretty low that's what i'm saying dude but, i would just uh, slap him on and send it yeah but maybe i have to uh set a point for alignment though yeah i just got this one back from automotive like i don't Wednesday. know if they'll work on this because i want to slam this so. dude they can give you a good start and then you can tweak it from there well i don't think it'll get on the rack they went out and bought wood for me. I'm sure they could figure it out. Maybe. So, anyways, we're gonna go get Boba. We'll see y'all in a minute. Change of plans. Danny's let me drive the LS. Dude, this thing. F I feel like I'm sitting on a couch. Like actually, look at all these buttons. They were all futuristic in the day. This is so funny. The curtains. It looks kind of you guys are gonna That's love this. You guys are gonna Some love this. Like Watch when oh, the dude, steering wheel like moves. Look at this. Dude, it just moved goes, on its own. The pillow goes in between your neck. That's the best part. <laughs> oh my god. god, dude. This thing's crazy. All right, let me just get my bearings oh, and then yeah, we'll go. Oh, shit. The headliner's mint. Yeah, it is. Seatbelts, kids. Magic school bus. Dude, I don't know if I've ever like driven a car this big. This feels like when this I used to drive the though. Suburban, dude. Like the Cedric? Excuse me. It's a man. big body, but this is this is a true big body. Please get out of the way. Thank you. Brakes are kind of shady. <laughs> Just drill this 
lady. I'm just kidding. I'm not actually gonna do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this dude, he's pulling in front of me. All right, all right, all right. Dude, this thing's crazy. Do you care if I take it out? Oh my, all right. Dude, the steering wheel is probably four times the size of my goddamn steering wheel. Telling you guys, just chopping on idle right here. Blah 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 blah. Let's see. Said he was gonna rev it. I kind of feel bad for everybody. Oh my God. <laughs> so loud. That is way too loud for this car. If you don't know what's going on, but if you're into cars, this is this is badass. My favorite part along with Spencer's is this little antenna that moves all on oh, its own, it, dude. It adjusts when I change. Um... When you change station. frequencies yeah. or stations or something? <laughs> yeah, I'll try to do it. All right, let's see. Dude, <laughs> what? That's insane. Oh my God. All right, we're getting Bova for real this time. I like trying new things. I got an Oreo slush. It's pretty much like an Oreo milkshake with Bova. It's pretty good. Danny, what'd you get? Pina colada slush. Pina colada slush, how is it? It's pretty good. I like Smacking. Anyway. I saw that and I almost thought about getting it. Or I thought about getting it, yeah. Uh, yeah, I usually get um, like the wintermelon milk tea mm -hmm. and, uh, or the mango slush. Yeah, that'll give us a good transition to Spencer's mango slush, as always. But we're just chilling. I'm going to see if Danny and Spencer don't mind getting some rollers of my car, maybe. Yeah? Yeah. You can, you can ride past it. That car is perfect for rollers. Then we're good. We're going to get some rollers of it in just a minute. We almost made it home. Oh, the purple one? Purple yeah. warning Oh one? yeah, that works. Yeah, that works. I, mean, I guess he got some fire rollers. I, I haven't seen them yet. I was rolling up the hill and I hear this like, ch -ch -ch. I was like, oh God, what is that? And then um, <laughs> it's clearly, clearly a uh, flat tire here. Right, I guess I didn't get this purple flashing ball for no reason, did I? Bada bop, boop, bow. Oh yeah. Anyways, dude, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I have a jack for one and two. I don't really, I don't have it in my tools. So we'll, we'll figure it out, I guess. Worst case, we're like two minutes home. They're 19s or 17s, yeah? Damn, this was loose. <laughs> yeah, those loose as fuck. We're not gonna talk about I that one. It's not. Nah? Dang. All right, we're gonna go to my house and see if I can get the stuff to do it. No. So, wish me luck. Also, Right as I was pulling out of the parking lot to get the fire rollers, my damn seatbelt thing broke. Uh, this, the, okay, I don't know if this was ever connected. I'm sure it was at the bottom of the seat, but this came unbolted. So I don't know what we gonna do, but uh, we gonna figure it out. Wish me luck. This is how Spencer chooses to drive. 
This dude could hold his arm out of the back window. <laughs> you can't even reach the top of it, dude. Anyways, we're getting some duels. Got the lugs on, and we're gonna hopefully put it on the ground and see. Okay, I dropped it way too fast on accident. It fits. Dude, these rotas just always look good on this car. Got the Mitch mass, mi mixed matched drift look going on, whatever. It's fire. But I have a little surprise for you guys right now. And there's this guy that always come in, comes into work and gets parts for a different vehicle. He shows up today driving a 240Z. This is Grant's 240. Um, super nice dude. He pulled over and asked to help all original, original motor and everything. And we were like, dude, <laughs> there's just a 240 driving through the neighborhood. This thing's absolutely beautiful, but we should have everything back together on the skyline to at least limp it the half mile home. So I really do like this setup on the car, but I think what I'm gonna do, I don't wanna do it. Jack up the car, take these wheels off, keep the gray ones up front, and then keep my my OG wheels, the stock ones, well, stock ones on the back, just so I can drive it comfortably. And then we should be good from there. But my alignment is, they gotta finish up the back. They did the camber, but I don't think they did the toe or uh, finalized it anyways, because those bushings are shot. That's what I'm gonna do so I can drive it with Ryan tomorrow. Pretty sure you guys are gonna think I'm just as dumb as how I think I'm dumb right now. I literally had, I, I have the small toolbox that's in my friend's car. I have my impact and the 19 and everything in my trunk. So, oh boy. But just a quick reminder before I dive into this, man. The number one best thing about car ownership is driving it. Driving it, thrashing it, getting on it. Just enjoying the car for exactly what it was made for. I always try to remind myself that dude it's a car anything can be fixed and just go out and enjoy it so that's what i'm gonna do and if something breaks you just take a deep breath and you fix it let's do it i'm looking at the tires i have on my stock wheels and I don't know if it would be better to just keep the works on the rear. Yeah, so what it came down to is I can see the pattern on the stock wheels and I cannot see the pattern on the work wheels. So that's what we're gonna keep. I don't know what it is with mismatched wheels, but holy shit, like, <laughs> I just like the drift look. Like, it's kind of, kind of ratchet, kind of doesn't look good, but in a way, it looks, it looks good. It's like two-tone gray with pink lugs, you know? Anyways, whatever. Oh, uh, we're gonna back it off, take it around the neighborhood, just real quick. I don't have my seatbelt thing attached yet. And then I don't know if I'll do that tonight or tomorrow morning, and I'm gonna contact Sam and see if he can do the tires tomorrow morning, because I can't run on these bad boys for, for long. So let's take it out. That one was for you, Carmelo. All right, update, that's uh, way too fun. Like way, way too fun. Skinny ass tires on the back. You just give it some gas and then feather it, buttery. I gotta clean up all this stuff, put the car back in the garage. It's driving fine. Bushings Friday, bushings to tomorrow possibly. And uh, Ryan comes tomorrow as well. So we will have some more content with that. But this has been Fitz Miller and the Skyline back here with a long overdue video. And we will see you guys in the next one. Have a good night.